The exhibition is actually divided into a tripartite form, looking first at China's magnificent past with the arts of Buddhism and the great sculpture collection that was built by another resident of this area, Dr. Arthur M. Sackler. Those objects were donated to Columbia University and we are very, very proud to have this opportunity to work with Columbia to have many of these documentary pieces in the exhibition. The centerpiece of the exhibition is extremely important to us because for the first time the objects that originally filled this house with uh, in the time of its former owners are going to be brought back and put on view in the residence. This, as many of you may know, was the former home of Childs Frick and his wife Frances. Childs Frick was the son of the great industrialist and important collector of the Frick collection, Henry Frick. And during the time that they lived here, the Fricks, Frick family collected Chinese blue and white ceramics. Over 80 pieces are brought together in this exhibition and arranged in a thematic display that brings attention to new ways of looking at these objects other than home and residential decoration. The objects from the Freck are one of the first times that the Freck is lending uh, so many objects to an exhibition. It's not usually a lending institution, so it's a very choice group of objects that you know, have never really been presented uh, in the way that they will be presented in total in this particular exhibition. 